What's going on everyone? Scott Troop here. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be talking about season 28 of The Bachelor with our guy Joey from Charity Season of The Bachelorette. Obviously we all know Joey. We all know Joey's story from being on Charity Season. Um, he was a great honest guy throughout the whole journey. Never caused any problems or anything. Uh, that's why the fan base liked him so much and that's why he eventually got asked to be the bachelor if you don't know who joey is he's a 28 year old tennis pro originally from pennsylvania living in hawaii currently so not a bad send off for whichever lucky lady uh, joey does propose to at the end of this uh, getting to move to um, hawaii so this video is mainly just going to be kind of my uh, predictions of who i think the uh, final four is going to be and then who I believe Joey is going to get down on one knee and propose to at the end of this journey. Now, watching the trailers that ABC, uh, Bachelor Nation, all that has put out, um, it does look like it's going to be a pretty interesting uh, season overall. Um, and I think a season with uh, not as much drama, which um, I believe the fan base likes overall. It seemed like Zach's season did not have a lot of drama either, which I think was very well... Uh, received uh, throughout the fan base. I think it was more about, you know, what the show's supposed to be about. In theory, it's supposed to be about, you know, finding finding your person and eventually getting uh, down on one knee and proposing to someone. Obviously, you're going to have drama, you know, throughout the process, but it was toned down, especially compared to, you know, a couple, the past couple seasons prior, uh, both Bachelor and Bachelorette. Uh, this season looks uh, looks like the same. Uh, it does look like, obviously, there will be some drama, as we just mentioned, but uh, nothing over-the-top crazy. And then the end of uh, the little two, two-and-a-half-minute trailer that they did put out, uh, it does look like uh, kind of an unprecedented ending. I know, obviously, that's kind of the joke, you know, most dramatic season ever, um, you know, all the taglines that they say every year, but... You know, who, who knows, maybe it will be true this year that we'll see an ending that we haven't ever seen before. So let's just first dive in. My first member of Joey's Final Four is going to be Charissa. Carissa, I believe it's Charissa. She's from British Columbia. Her bio says she likes to read Colleen Hoover novels, uh, Brewery, Scrabble, and Golf. Uh, she was also born on Christmas, so that's pretty cool. Um, she's 26 years old, uh, marketing director. Uh, I believe she will be one of Joey's final four women. Next up, we have Lexi, a 30-year-old digital strategist from Atlanta, Georgia. Her bio reads here that she was accepted into an MBA summer program at MIT, and as a child, she moved over 15 times. So that's interesting. Now, I will interject here and say this is obviously all. This is no spoilers. This is no nothing. This is just going off of... You know, the clips that we have seen uh, throughout the trailers, uh, both the, the full trailer, two, two and a half minute version, and then some of the other 30 second uh, trailer spots that they have put out. No uh, no spoilers, no, no nothing. This is just uh, going off of that, uh, going through the footage of that a couple times and uh, trying to piece together who I think is going to be in the final four. Next, who I believe will be the runner up for this season of The Bachelor, we have Jen. She is a 25-year-old physician assistant student from Miami, Florida. Her bio reads she loves paddleboarding, reading, uh, Shawn Mendes music, and she's also bilingual. Very interesting, but based on the trailers and whatnot, I believe she will be in the final four, and I believe she will be the runner-up. But I believe the final choice and person that Joey will propose to at the end of the season is none other than Daisy. Daisy is a 25-year-old account executive from Becker, Minnesota. Daisy's bio reads, just like Taylor Swift, she was born on a Christmas tree farm. Her parents have been married for over 30 years, and she wants to find a lasting love story just like them. That is sweet. Based on the trailer, she was in the trailers a lot, which obviously that doesn't always give away like what it is, but in some of the in some of the spots uh, that she was in the trailer, looked like it was you know, multiple different locations, which obviously more than likely means multiple dates and multiple dates later in the season. Also, some of the locations look like, uh, you know, final couple destination spots, if that makes sense, given uh, given the show's track record for where they usually go towards the end of the season. So that's that. That's who I believe is going to be in Joey's final four. Carissa, Lexi, Jen, and Joey's pick, who we will get down on one knee and propose to, at the end of this journey, 
daisy. See if I'm right, usually hit or miss on this uh, whenever I do this every year. So we'll see, we'll track this along the way, but thank you all so much for watching. Let's enjoy the season and see y'all in the next one. Peace out.